First of all, I want to make sure everybody can hear me. Yeah. And I want everyone to know the rain is not Scott's fault. <laughs> Michelle's mom told me it always rains every time Michelle has an important event in her life. <laughs> yeah, I just wanted to clear that up. Okay. Initially, I had some concern about this couple because our family seemed so different. <laughs> but instead of the differences, I decided to focus on some similarities. Michelle's mom kept, keeps ledgers and does some kind of bookkeeping, and Scout's Grandpa Joe was a bookie. Michelle comes from a large, more traditional family. Her, mon is, her mom is one of nine siblings from Long Island, from the East Coast. And then there's our family from the West Coast. And, and it's complicated. <laughs> At first, Scott and I thought we had such a small family in comparison. Then he started his list of family. They included adopted relatives, birth relatives, step-parents, siblings, nieces, namesake, and friends from all over the world. Soon we, oh, now I'm getting emotional. <laughs> <laughs> Soon we realized that Scott has created a huge family like a quilt, unique and put together with love. I'd like to start, start off telling you how Scott and Michelle met at church. <laughs> That's what I would like to do, but it didn't happen that way. <laughs> for years, Scott searched all over the world for his true love. <laughs> he brought women home from France, from England, Russia, South America, and even Nashville. <laughs> After all these attempts to meet his true love, he was almost ready to give up the search. Then he came to me for advice in one last try, which was kind of ironic because I've been single for decades. <laughs> so he says, okay, I'm going to do this ad. And I said, what's your tagline going to be? He said, well, I was thinking October surprise because I was born in October. I said, no, son. <laughs> Go with green-eyed Scorpio. <laughs> and okay, so that's when divine intervention inter came in. They both swapped right, swiped right, and said, I pray this is the one. I quickly realized that Michelle was different. She was a strong, independent woman. She, and she did not agree with everything Scott said. The first time she challenged him, that got his attention. They don't compliment each other only. They challenge each other to be the best versions of themselves. Here we go. One last page. <laughs> One last page, yeah. Go. <laughs> I love everything about Michelle. Aww. Well, almost everything. <laughs> there was this time last Christmas. I, asked, I was Christmas shopping, and I asked Michelle, what size do you wear? <laughs> and she said, do you know how some things come in extra, extra small? And I said, no, I don't. <laughs> <laughs> and I didn't like her at that moment. <laughs> but she said she's gained a little weight, and she's now up to an extra small. 
Michelle, welcome to our family, and we're glad Scott waited long enough to finally get it right. <laughs> and, I, and I would like to end with a quote and a nod to Scott's Nana Winnie. Piglet asks, how do you spell love? Pooh answered, you don't spell it, you feel it. And we all feel it, love tonight. <laughs>